Well, today marks the last day for Toledo's leader in fighting gun violence on Toledo streets. Juwan Armour says he will be working to continue his, the program for the last few days here while the violence interrupters still patrol the streets in the Junction Inglewood area. And tonight, Roxanne Elias spoke to residents in the neighborhood who want to see the program continue. It used to be we would sit on the front porch all night and kick it and talk and everything. Now, if you hear the dog bark, you're going back in the house. The Junction Inglewood neighborhood has been riddled with violent crime. Tondra Izell has lived here for more than 60 years. She's the great great aunt of 10 year old Demaya Izell, who was shot and killed last month while riding in a car with her uncle. Where do we stop? Where does it end? What, what do we have to do to stop all the violence? She says Juwan Armour, the program manager for Toledo's Gun Violence Reduction Initiative, was working to do just that in her neighborhood. And she's sad to hear he's leaving. In this area, we didn't see as much going on as it had been. Because like I said, I've been living over here. I've seen a lot of things happen, a lot of things going. It seemed like it calmed down. Harold Minks, who lives right up the street, agrees. As of now, I have seen a diminished in crime, in street crime particularly, uh, versus last year. He believes the program, which had the so-called violence interrupters walking the streets, was working. And I have met the uh, interrupters and I think they are doing a positive uh, deal with, within their community. And they need to keep it up because uh, at least you do have an ear and a voice out there other than the police just speaking. Toledo Safety Director Brian Bird says they're looking at options to replace armor. It could be someone on the inside or someone on the outside, and they may need to do some restructuring to the program. The neighbors we spoke with made it clear they want the violence interrupters program to continue, but ultimately they're just hoping the city brings in the right person to fill armor's shoes. What do we need to do to start from here to continue on the journey he has started us on? Because I truly believe it is a journey. It's a journey that we need to continue to travel in order to see some positive things and some changes in Toledo.